<laughs> Mom would kill me if she knew I was out here. I can't believe Rengus is playing a show at the old mill. Fuck yes! Music so intense I can't hear myself think? Sounds like heaven to me. If I'm gonna get inside, I'll have to get through that door. somebody a thousand dollars, I'd be shitting my pants. Those guys need to get a room. Sorry, okay. It's just a bit cool. I didn't think Shut up! You owe. You fucking owe me. It's that simple. Hey, up. Okay. Okay. I get it. This RV's just begging for a little street art. But if I do it here, someone will see me. Perfect place for me to work. Now what to draw? dog crate at an abandoned mill? Weird. Ugh, this bend shreds so hard. 
I gotta get in there. A second door inside? So close, and yet so far. Mom would totally flip her shit if she knew I hiked for an hour just to see a show. This place is sketchy as hell. An old abandoned building in the middle of nowhere, miles from home. Home. Right. Now I remember why I'm here. Any place is better than home. Say the world will end in fire. Guess fire safety isn't exactly high on the agenda here. Oh. I'd join a motorcycle gang if I had any friends. That saw looks ancient. I wonder how long ago the mill actually closed. An old lumber car. <laughs> Guess it's been years since anyone's actually worked here. Help you miss. You gotta let me in. Check it. I'm totally legit. <laughs> it's not a bad fake. Put your in over your head here. Do yourself a favor and scram. Can't let him push me around. Should I go back and stand up to him? Or can something around here help me convince him? Fucking owe me. It's that simple. Now pay up. Somebody a thousand dollars, I'd be shitting my pants. I didn't think it'd go down like that. Shut up. Keep walking, kid. God, again. What do you want, kid? I have to convince this doorstop that I belong here. I thought we went over this. Isn't it past your bedtime? Aww, isn't it past yours? <laughs> Real cute. But if I don't know you, you're not getting in. Riding tiny mopeds are cute. I'm more like Red Sonia riding a panzer tank. Okay, kid. You're tough. I get it. I am not a damn kid. Other things I'm not. Young lady, kiddo, chica, sweet cakes. A girl like you... I can't protect you in there. Girls? Girls kick ass, you idiot. 
I can take care of myself. My boss will kill me if I let you in. Meet your new boss. It's called my fist. You're not accepting no for an answer, are you? Nope. And you really think you can take me? Yep. What if I have a knife? No problem. Gun? Don't care. What if I have a... You could have a flamethrower, an army of robot ninjas, and a motherfucking dragon on a leash in there. And I'd still kick your ah, ass. Ah, 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 ah. I give up. You're all right with me, kid. Go on in. This is intense! Shit! Hey, Delia. Come. Come on, man. Follow the lights and the sound. Can't wait to get in there and thrash. That dog is fierce. What's your name? Delia. She doesn't usually like people. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, me neither. Sober up, girl. You're missing the show. <laughs> Damon Merrick again. Who is this guy? Selling merch? I wish I had some cash. I, I can't, I can't. That Rangus shirt is rad. No, 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 look. Hey, are you selling any Rangus? 20 bucks. What? 20 bucks for a t-shirt. That's robbery. Dick. Looks like that parking brake is the only thing keeping that car from rolling down the ramp. What's wrong with me? Where to start? How can you just chill when Rangus is tearing it up in the next room? Central. 
cold beer. Free for the taking? Drink more, feel less. Yes, please. Arcadia Bay 15. Didn't expect these guys to be so political. No thanks. I try to avoid hepatitis when I can. What is he doing here? Half those stairs are rotted through. Looks dicey. Yo, Frank. Hey. Chloe? I know your name, you idiot. You bought pot from me every month for a year. You stand out like a sore thumb. What are you even doing here? I'm here to see Rangus, man. They rock. How did you hear about this little shindig? Cut the internet? How else? Seriously? <sighs> okay, so you holding? I could definitely use something to take the edge off. You know the drill. Cash up front, then you get high. I'm gonna need to scrounge up some cash if I want to score. Unless he's feeling generous. How about you spot me some? You know I'm good for it. No way! I learned my lesson last time. Money first. Yes, Frank's not the generous type. Never mind then. Suit yourself. Judge me, spooky deer head. I'm here for Rangus. Doesn't let go once you get your teeth in there. Graffiti everywhere. I think they missed a spot. Cancelled? God, Prescott's a real tool. Hold 
charge you 20 bucks. You looking to get beat? Guy's a dick. If I want a shirt, I'm going to need to get creative. Mr. Merch, asshole, motherfucker, dumb face, Mick Fuckstick. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. no. Come on. Shit, I'm rich. Nothing sadder than a neglected bong. She returned. a lot or yeah right it's cool I'm really glad you approve okay so you holding I could definitely use something to take the edge off you know the drill cash up front then you get high how much will this buy me oh hey <laughs> you want to get stabbed I think everyone saw. Whatever. Where's my pot? This is definitely not oregano, okay? Come to mama. You're a good man, Frank. No. I'm not. Don't be the price. You're cramping my style. I'll see you later. Whatever.
nothing sadder than a neglected bong. Nothing sadder than a neglected bong. Zero shits. Let me know how that works out for you. Bitch. All right. Mosh pit is a no-go. Fine. Maybe I can get a better view of the action from up above. Those guys are trouble. If I want to see the band, I'll have to find another way. Just like the one mom refused to get me for my birthday. Sweet night. Just like the one mom refused to get me for my birthday.
No one steals from me. I want my fucking money. Shit. 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 I can't show this asshole weakness. I can't back down. <laughs> Two against one is no good. But maybe I can turn them against each other. I'm gonna kill you! We all die, nothing to fear there. Or didn't you get that memo? Oh, she's confident. Look at the way she's dressed! She's trash! <laughs> I don't need fashion tips from someone who, how can I put this, dresses like a meth pinata? Him, not you. <laughs> Dude, she's smoking you. This bitch needs to shut up, and so do you. Oh, keep this up and I'll make you my bitch. I think you'd like that, unless you've got first dibs. Sheldon, I don't know, man. She, maybe she's all right. Shut the fuck. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, you idiot! Your name's Sheldon? His name is Sheldon? What does that matter? No, no, it's just... It's not what I would have guessed. <laughs> it is kind of a pussy name, man. She's a loser! Why are you listening to her? I believe that everyone's a loser. But you most of all. You are the winner of the loser award! You get first runner-up. She's kicking your ass, dude. You're gonna regret every word, Chica. Every word. Oh, I bet you make a lot of girls regret a lot of things, like being within ten feet of you. What? It's like she knows you. <laughs> For the last time, shut up, man. Well, I think it's time for you to legally change your name to Shithead. Oh, you are a shithead sometimes. <laughs> Damn it! Help me out here! You should go ahead and call 911. I think your friend is about to cry himself to death. Think you're so smart. Smarter than you. She did kind of school you. <laughs> Shut up! You're pathetic! You're dead meat! Your face is its own form of birth control. Oh, that's it, you stupid- I'm jealous of everyone who's never met you. Man, screw you, you self-righteous- Are you a man, or are you a giant, walking, talking, sleeveless pile of shit? <laughs> <laughs> I can't show this asshole weakness. I can't back down. <laughs> Two against one is no good, but maybe I can turn them against each other. I'm gonna kill you! <gasps> is two versus one really fair? Cause I can wait if you wanna go get more guys. Look at the way she's dressed. She's trash. Yeah, total trash. Boring! Just go away already. Oh, she thinks she's got game, bitch! Let's everybody take it down a notch, okay? Oh, oh, Sheldon, do you do you feel like taking it down a notch? I don't, actually. Ugh, I'm gonna need a few more beers to deal with you two. Oh, she wants some beer. <laughs> Losers don't get beer. Losers get hurt. Getting a little tired of your empty threats and shit talking. I think she's calling us out, dude. She's gonna regret every word. Every word. I'm I'm hearing a lot of talk from you. Where's the action? I think it's time we give her what she wants. What are, you what are you waiting for? Put up or shut up? Oh, she's really throwing down. No help's coming, girl. This is it. God, you two talk too much. Let's go already! Damn, okay. This guy is not screwing around. Oh, shit. What do I do? This is happening too fast. Hey, dickhead. I've got to act. I've got to do something. So we're doing this. This is happening. This is gonna be good. Hope you like pain. I'm serious. You wanna see me get angry here? Because I'm getting there, and it won't be pretty. It won't. Get your hands off her. 
Taylor always reminds me of a vanilla-flavored mannequin that walks around in designer jeans, judging everyone. Chloe, I was just thinking about you. What? My mom and I were cleaning out some of my old clothes. I volunteer at Goodwill, and I was wondering if maybe you'd like me to bring some for you to try on? Maybe something a little less... beer-stained? How nice of you, Taylor. I'm just looking out for you. We girls have to stick together. Believe it or not, I'm actually able to dress myself. Thanks. Oh, I know. I just heard times are tough, and I volunteer, you know? You're a saint. By the way, what's the word on you and Rachel? Everyone's talking about that photo of the two of you from last night. It's funny, I guess. I only say that because I had a party at my place last night and Rachel didn't come. Wow, that is so strange. I can't imagine why she wouldn't want to do that. Right? But I guess the two of you got up to some fun. I want to hear all about it. I guess my invitation got lost in the mail. Totally. You also weren't there, and we were all really sad about that. But whatever, you were out having crazy fun. Where did you two go? You'll have to hear about it from someone else. I don't have the energy to talk to you right now. I hope she chokes on an ice cube. Oh my gosh. Did you party literally all night? What amazing venue was this? Well, look, I'm going to go let my mom know it's a definite yes on my old clothes. And then you can tell me all about last night's event while you're trying them on. Insulting my clothing and then trolling me for information about Rachel? I'm going to make her admit how fake she is. Okay, cut the shit, Taylor. We're not friends, so stop acting like we are. What are you talking about? You and me, Chloe. Remember all the good times we had in freshman algebra? Are you sure we had algebra together? Um, maybe I'm thinking of someone else? Zero points for random guessing. I think you mean the good times you gave Mr. Terry with your boobs hanging out in the front row. I sat in the back, remember? Well, even so, I think we should be better friends. I'm sure we have a lot in common. What are you talking about? We're completely different. No, Chloe, we might seem different, but deep down, we're the same. Not really. I know we're both big users, but I've never used people. Quit blowing sunshine up my ass. It's dark in there for a reason. I'm just trying to be nice. You don't have to bite my head off. You're right. We should go clubbing sometime. I can do blow while you're doing blowjobs. You have such a unique sense of humor. So, like, biting and sarcastic, I just love that. <sighs> Look, I heard this fake nice spiel from Victoria already. Now you? Coordinate your strategies, skanks. You're angry because two different people were nice to you today? Taylor, I mean this sincerely. I hope you go camping this weekend. I hope it's perfect weather, and I hope a bear eats you. You are such an unhappy person. Are you sure I'm unhappy? Because watching you grovel for Rachel Amber's attention is making me feel pretty good. Chloe, being unhappy is a state of mind that you control. Dr. Phil said that. Save your pity. You'll need it when Victoria finds someone else to wipe her ass. Fine. You win. I don't want to be friends with you. I'd never be your friend. Are you happy now? Jeez. I really hit a nerve there. I am always telling people how much personality you have. Anyway, I'll let my mom know it's a definite yes on my old clothes. See ya, Chloe. What the fuck? Frank? Frank! Gotta make sure Frank's okay first. He saved my ass today. Frank has to be in his RV. And by the looks of that blood, 
he's in bad shape. I need to know if Frank's okay. Or alive. Frank's out cold. I need some way to wake him up. Yelling didn't work. What's next? I need something to clean that stab wound. Shit. Frank's in bad shape. I need to do something. Hang on, Frank. I'll figure something out. Some alcohol should do the trick. Frank probably keeps something boozy within reach. I can't just dump this on Frank. I need something to soak it up. A t-shirt would probably work. I saw a laundry basket back in his bedroom. Okay. I'm coming, Frank. If I don't find a way to clean that wound, Frank is toast. Bet this will clean a knife wound. And hurt like hell doing it. Probably won't be the first time this shirt has been soaked in alcohol. Medical grade t-shirt. Coming right up. This would probably stop the bleeding. But it's not exactly sterile. Now's not a good time to dig through Frank's dirty laundry. I can't just leave until I know Frank's stable. Guess Frank enjoys a good blackout at the end of a long day. I'm glad Frank stood up for us with Damon. I'm just... I feel like there's more going on here. Leave her alone! Get away from her! No. But I won't fight you. <laughs> just let the girl go. Just don't... Don't... Just don't hurt the girl. Please. Rachel has a mother. <laughs> Who have you hurt? Is she... Is she gonna be okay? Look at where you are, Chloe. You obviously love my daughter. To try so hard. I can't tell you how much I want to be a part of Rachel's life. What I would do to make it happen. It isn't about beating James. It's about what Rachel can take. It's about the father she deserves. Don't steal that from her. You have no idea what I've done to her. When Rachel was a baby, I... I almost... I almost killed her. It was summer. I remember the way the jasmine smelled on the ride home. We had been out. Grocery shopping. Mother and daughter. I had such a hard day. I was so tired. I just... I, I needed to take the edge off. I got home, and the first thing I did was use. It had been a while, and it... Oh, it felt so good. But I forgot about Rachel. I... I left her in the car. She was so small, you know? She was just so small, and it was so hot, and... If James hadn't come home early that day, she... she she that was when he took her that was that was why i i put what i wanted I, what i felt like i needed first i always do i've lost so much don't take this away from me too let me give this one thing to her but hear me when i say that there is nothing you can say that will convince me to stay. Clever, girl. I'm supposed to make this chick high, make the DA's little family problem disappear. Uh, anyone else going to come around the corner? Or is it just you two? <laughs> you think I'm a fucking idiot? James Amber came to me. Because he was desperate. And now, 
I'm squeezing him for all he's worth. Whatever James told you, Sarah doesn't deserve this. She didn't do anything wrong. You think I give a shit about what she did? My job is to make problems go away. And she's the problem. Thank you.